Well, hi, everybody. Good morning to meteorologist Travis Klineski here on this Tuesday morning, but an interesting night of uh, ice and now snow. Um, ice storm warnings officially do continue until 3 o'clock this afternoon here in the dark purple shade or that that. Yeah, that darker purple shade, I guess you'd call it here. These are areas that have been slammed hard with ice, some places a half inch to a, or a quarter of an inch to a half inch of ice. And there was a lot of heavy rainfall. It fell quickly and then quickly froze with temperatures below freezing. Um, and these areas probably won't see as much snow. And because of that, it's going to remain mostly slick because of the ice. So that's why it's an ice storm morning until 3 o'clock. The rest of the area, winter weather advisory. Uh, the winter weather advisory here, this is mostly for light glaze of ice, but under a quarter of an inch of icing there. And then farther to the uh, west, ice may be mixing in with snowfall there. And then some areas that have had ice, but will pick up a little bit more snow up here. It's just Oh, we just hit it, took another power hit. <laughs> it's been an interesting morning here this morning. We've taken a number of power hits here at the TV station. Um, in fact, my TV just got turned on because of the mute. <laughs> so you may have seen that flash on there. If you rewind it, you'll see that flash. Yeah, we took a quick power hit. Um, anyway, um, uh, to the northwest there, it's ice, but now combined with snow, and this is where your best chance of accumulating snow is going to be is in those locations right there. Let's look at future cast as the snow moves in here. It's not quite lined up with what is currently going on as of 7, 13 in the morning here. Um, I'm gonna actually going to show you a, a quick look at what the radar actually looks like as of the time I'm recording this. There's actually a lot more snow than what's showing up on future cast here. But uh, again, as we go through our morning, that snow will continue here, and there could be some heavier bands of snowfall, some icing out towards the east. And then as we uh, see things clear out as we get towards later on today and into uh, uh, tonight, uh, this afternoon, we'll start to get some sunshine that returns. Tomorrow we're going to be, or tonight we're going to be looking at clear skies, cold conditions tomorrow, quieter conditions with lots of sunshine and warming temperatures out there uh, throughout the uh, day tomorrow. Looks a little bit better than today. Here comes a, an approaching cold front though towards tomorrow night from the northwest. So snowfall amounts, not super heavy, but we could see some areas that pick up maybe around one to two inches of snow. Wouldn't be surprised to see some isolated three inch amounts up there to the north of the interstate. Most places under two inches. And in fact, again, to the southeast, it'll be well under an inch of snowfall. Temperatures out there, 30s and 40s later on today, and maybe even upper 20s there in Albion. It's going to be a cold day for today. Tonight, dropping back into the 20s for overnight lows. Tomorrow, better, 40s and 50s, coldest in the northeast, especially if there's snow on the ground. Tomorrow night back down into the 20s to near 30. And then your Thursday, a cooler day behind that cold front. A lot of us back down into the 40s. Long range, again, we have that colder air for your Thursday. Starts to warm up a little bit on Friday. Friday night, a slight chance of some light rain. Friday night into Saturday morning, a better chance in eastern Nebraska. A warmer Saturday on the way. And then Sunday, a little bit of a cool down with more wind behind a weak cold front. Monday starts to warm up again as we'll see some warmer air coming in for next week. Thank you all for watching. I appreciate it. Hope you all have a wonderful day. Take care. Enjoy your day. And God bless. Bye. Be safe out there on the roads.